coming into the British Coxless 4 rowing team, Andrew Triggs Hodge had some big shoes to fill. Following in the steps of Steve Redgrave, Matthew Pinsent and James Cracknell, he was part of the gold medal winning foursome at the Beijing Olympics four years ago. Now preparing for his second appearance on the grandest stage in world sport, this time on home waters, Driggs Hodge will be looking to continue his own legacy. Now I've kind of laid the standard for what I want to achieve at the Olympics and in life. So um, I, I look towards London with a, a half an expectation that I'm not going to be happy unless I walk away with a gold medal. But I know I've trained hard for this. I've, I've committed my life to it. Um, and I'm going to throw everything at London 2012. He took up the sport while a student at Staffordshire University and subsequently joined Molesey Boat Club. Hours of practice paid off when he was selected for the under-23 World Championships in Cox 4, with the team finishing sixth. He had better luck at the 2003 Senior Championships in the eight, where the team took a bronze. Triggs Hodge made his Olympic debut the following year in the same event, but they were unable to trouble the medal winners. In 2005, he was selected as part of the new Coxless Four after the retirements of Pinsent, Cracknell and Ed Cood. And the pair were joined by Peter Reid and Alex Partridge. The quartet won the 2006 World Championships and with Tom James replacing Partridge, the 2008 Olympics. Coming home with a gold medal was, I was absolutely uh, astonished. I mean, I, I, as a kid, I never thought I was an Olympian achieve that uh, to sort of make my parents proud and to do to, to bring home the gold medal was uh, a moment of my life which I'll never forget and something I'll uh, will always remain with me. With Triggs Hodge having continued Team GB's fine tradition on the water he turned his attentions to pairs as well as fours. Alongside Reed he's now won three world silver medals. With an Olympic gold and a raft of world medals Triggs Hodge is well on his way to establishing himself as a successor to the teams of the past. And there'll never be a better occasion than London 2012 to add to his personal tally.